Air France has confirmed that its restructuring plan threatens nearly 3,000 jobs, prompting a violent reaction from part of the workforce. A meeting of the Works Council was stormed by protesters. Management says it intends to press charges after two senior directors were manhandled. Pierre Plissonnier, the airline's director at Orly Airport, and Xavier Brossetta, the head of human resources, had their shirts ripped from their backs. Brossetta escaped by climbing a fence. One union official says he almost got lynched. Air France denounced the acts of isolated but particularly violent individuals, acknowledging that the main staff protest had been peaceful. The management's plans could involve compulsory dismissals if voluntary departures can't be agreed. Pilots who are being asked to fly more hours for the same pay have been at the forefront of opposition to the restructuring, but the majority of jobs lost are set to be among ground staff. Air France also wants to reduce the number of long-haul flights. The airline also says it needs to be more competitive with low-cost rivals on short-haul.